appreciate that. <laughs> this weekend, athletes, including some of Utah's own, are competing in a pretty unique kind of championship. Yeah, they are going to need guts, determination, oh, and something from a hardware store, like a <laughs> shovel. Here's Peter Rosen's fresh look on life. <laughs> Chad Denny. Bad Chad Denny. That's my name. Is trying to take back his title. Here we go. On a shovel. It's the poor man's luge, we call it. You fall off your shovel. Get back on it. Denny grew up around Angel Fire, New Mexico, the birthplace of shovel racing. There he won two world championships. Okay, this is Chad Denny. How fast do you go? 69 miles an hour. 69? Uh huh. Miles an hour. Miles an hour. It's a blur. You know, you're only about a foot off the ground. It's a complete rush. Keep it going downhill. There's never that thrill like the very first time. Yeah, don't hit the kids. It began. The lift ops used to use it as a, their tool for getting down. As ski area transportation. At the end of the day. Oh. A number 12 aluminum grain scoop shovel. With a little polish and wax, <laughs> it turned into a competitive thrill ride. Sure there's a shovel under there now? You can see it right here. <laughs> the sport evolved with the introduction of modified shovel racing. 15 in an incredible crash at the, the bottom. The purists prefer the original production class, just a man and a shovel. But for Chad Denny, two-time shovel racing champion, this is just a bunny hill. 30 seconds to go. After the 2002 Olympics, shovel racers held an unofficial competition down their dream course, the Utah Olympic Park bobsled run. Good Chad. I did the, the bobsled track from the top. It was some of the most fun in my life. He said we were pulling two G's in the corner. It was insane. Like being in a, in a car accident from the top all the way to the bottom. When you get to the bottom, actually, you come out OK. Here comes Chad Denny. Isn't that wild? I think you have to be a little bit cuckoo, you know? A little wacko to get out there and, and have some fun at it. At least that's what people tell me. So Chad Denny is polishing and practicing. He wants to be the best, to feel the thrill, <laughs> even if it's on a shovel. See the fun you can have with stuff you can buy at the hardware store? I'm Peter Rosen with a fresh look on life. Hey, now these bobsleds only get up to about 50 miles an hour on the, or the uh, shovels only get up to 50 miles an hour on the bobsled track. They go a lot faster when they go to the World Championships at the Angel Fire Resort. It's going to be a lot of fun. Guess what? We have a birthday boy with us today. Oh.